Odell Beckham Jr. worked out for a, a number of teams, Browns being one of them. Um, so it's Panthers, Giants, Patriots, Rams, Cardinals, 49ers, Bills, Chiefs, Vikings, Browns, and Ravens uh, were available. You, you'll see the patented one-handed grab. Uh, not only that, catching the, the end of the football. Um, take a look at this one. This looking like a catcher here on the little route going back, backhands it. Um, Dove Kleiman tweets out that he is hearing that Odell is looking for $20 million a year uh, per Mike Florio. Um, I can't imagine that, um, that he's going to get close to that. Uh, but I guess where I'm going to go with this, is there any way you could see the Browns bringing back Odell Beckham Jr.? Well, yeah, at first the $20 million seems – you know, absurd. He didn't play last year. And I get it's a depressed free agent receiver market. I get that. And I think you can make a legitimate argument that Odell's the best receiver available. Now, he didn't play last year. He's coming off two ACLs. $20 million seems like a big reach to me. As far as him coming back to the Browns, you know, I guess I'm not willing to close the door because they went to that workout, which opened the door, um, you know, doing their due diligence. It's been a while, you know, I guess a year has passed, more than a year since um, the divorce in 2021. But having said all that, I mean, he quit on this team. And yep. the GM's the same, the coach is the same, the owners are the same. And if I were in any of those spots, I, I don't care how popular he is in the locker room. Um, I couldn't trust him. And it's not like that. Was a, it's, and I don't buy that it was all about Baker Mayfield. You know, I've heard that Odell asked for a trade multiple times. Um throughout multiple years when he was here. So I think that's just his personality. I don't know if he ever, would ever be content here, um, maybe not anywhere. Uh, I, I just I, – I wouldn't bring him back. I think it's risky, even though he fits what you want to do, quick twitch and deep threat and probably loves Deshaun Watson. Um, I, I would not bring him back, and I, I think it's risky, and I think that would be too much money. Yeah, uh, I, um, I would tend to agree with you, and I don't think – I'm not buying that he's a locker room cancer or any of that. I just – for this spot, because of what happened here before, and the front office bent over backwards, gave him what he wanted, um, I just I, I don't think I would do that if I were the Browns.